All right, John, here's another one of your uh, 50th scale, 150th scale uh, fire truck. This is a, I'm assuming, Corgi. And that's how, what you call the dogs. So I'm assuming that's what, how you say it for the models as well. A Corgi model of a Mac CF. And I know so much about fire trucks that CF stands for a city fire fireman. So that no, was a joke anyway. Horrible joke at that. Um, the um, Everything on this truck, and it was missing the mirrors when I got it. So I don't know if you have those or if they were maybe even gone before you received the truck. I don't know. Uh, but the mirrors were missing. Everything else, uh, the rail on the back, everything, uh, the air horns, all the other stuff. You can tell I switched out the light bar. That was on there. It looked like somebody had added a uh, some kind of circuit board LED light bar set up. So I changed that out to another uh, type light bar. Uh, your little uh, outriggers and everything still function like they did. Um, forget to fold those down let me do that now because when i show the ladder i'll end up catching those so anyway um everything works uh, just like it did like i said when you sent it to me uh, of course ladder still raises and or the platform i guess this would be considered uh extends raises spins everything it's supposed to do so we're good there set that back down where it goes um, again, as I said about the other two models, these are pretty detailed. Um, I don't know. I didn't price any of them on eBay to see what these would run uh, for those interested. Um, I bet they're cheaper than what Code 3 would be. And of course, Code 3 doesn't make a uh, 150th. They do the 32nd and the 64th. Uh, so anyway, so a pretty cool model. Uh, like I said, fairly detailed considering. Uh, this one's set up like your other ones uh, for 18 volts uh, AC. So, of course, as the other ones didn't have, uh, anything designating red and black on the wires. So they can be hooked either way in your supplies. No, no problem with that. Um, put steady headlights in this. I was going to use actually one of my wigwag boards for the headlights. And once I got everything together, I didn't have room for it. So, uh, I fail there. So, we have steady headlights. Uh, red strobes in the front here. Uh, three red strobes in the uh, rooftop light bar. And then I added, it had red lights hanging under this platform in the back. Uh, so I removed those and added uh, red strobe LEDs to that. So again, it doesn't matter which way you hook up DC to it. So let's just hook a battery up to it here. If I can do it. And at least go over the lighting. Again, it will be brighter once you hook it to your track voltage. Uh, for the fact of it's going to be twice as much as what this 9 volt puts out they won't be twice as bright but they will definitely be probably 25 to 30 percent brighter so you see your steady headlights again red strobes over top of the headlights uh, red strobe light bar nothing too crazy with that spin this around here a little bit and you can see your red strobes underneath underneath the platform look pretty cool they'll look pretty really neat on a fire scene so so anyway, that's all there is to that one. And my thumb come off a wire. Um, anyway, I just wanted to get you, let you see it and see what you're receiving. So, John, I appreciate it. Thank you very much for the orders. And I'm going to try to get these other ones knocked out because I'm going on vacation next week. So I'm going to try to get things done for you, uh, at least hopefully by the end, if, if my real work job will leave me alone for a while. So thank you very much, sir.